Well, what's going on, Carnation? Man, rough game tonight. We had no offense in this game, literally, because we got shut out in this one, losing six to nothing to the Minnesota Twins in the second of three, after scoring six runs last night. And you know, I was hoping for the same, trying for a fourth straight win and another series victory, and uh. Yeah, and offense was very quiet in this one. No runs. Uh, we had only five hits. Twin starter Pablo Lopez was very good. Seven scoreless innings. Gave up just four hits. Struck out nine. Last year, he was an all-star with the Twins. And struck out, struck out 234 batters. And an outstanding strikeout-to-walk ratio. So, um... Yeah, uh, so Sonny Gray on the mound facing his former team in which he was an all-star last year with the Twins and was the runner-up in Cyan voting to uh, Garrett Cole. And Gray would get off to a great start, striking out the side in order in the bottom of the first. Then the Cardinals, unfortunately, would strand two runners, second and third at the top of the second to keep it scoreless. Uh, Mason went, or rather... Uh, Victor Scott would be picked off third base. Mason win a sacrifice bunt to advance Scott to third, but Victor would be picked off. Then at the bottom of the second, double and a walk, and then a three-run homer by Trevor Larnick. That would make it a three-to-nothing Minnesota lead with one swing. Uh, and for Trevor Larnick, his uh, 13th home run of the year. Then later in the inning, Max Kepler at RBI Fielder's Choice to make it a 4 to nothing Twins lead. Stay 4 to nothing until the bottom of the fifth. Trevor Larnick again. A solo home run this time. So a two-homer night for Larnick, now 14 on the year. Uh, and Gray would still get through six innings, allowing five runs, two homers, striking out seven. Uh, on 99 pitches, so not a not a terrible start. Uh, but yeah, just uh, couldn't get anything going against Pablo Lopez. A one, two, three. Well, actually, not one, two, three, but a scoreless seventh inning from uh, Matthew Libertor, down by five, and then uh, we would train runner on second in the top of the eighth to keep us off the board and then the bottom of the eighth Kyle Lee Hay on the mound and he would give up a solo home run a long home run to Matt Walner that would make it a 6 to nothing Twins lead for Walner uh, this is uh, second full season his ninth of the year and 25th RBI so that would make it a 6 to nothing Twins lead hard throwing Closer, although not a safe chance, Johan Duran would strike out to the ninth. He's a flamethrower. Uh, so, yeah, a disappointing loss for sure. After such a. It's been so. was going so great the past three games. So, um, yeah, so. Um, Early on in the start, Sonny Gray uh, was dealing. You know, he struck out the first three, uh, striking out the side on just 10 pitches, uh, but then got in trouble in that third inning. So, um, Willis Contreras was uh, hit by a pitch and then left the game in the sixth inning, uh, although he was hit by a pitch in the fourth, stayed in the game, but was pinch hit for by Matt Carpenter. So hopefully nothing serious for uh, Contreras. Uh, and yes, yeah, so hopefully we can win another series tomorrow when Eric Fetty gets a start. Uh, one in three as a Cardinal. Went up against rookie righty Zebby Matthews for Minnesota. So... Till Sunday before we come back home host the pod race. So till then, Count Express saying go cards.